Okay, guys, viewer is the one in the black pants with the red little sash. So that's our Kyokushin viewer named Min. He just checked a kick. He's trying a Lethway match. Ooh, turned his back a little bit. So right now, you got to adjust to the Lethway rules, right? And Lethway is probably one of the most hardcore martial arts. Ooh, he just sort of got swept or he tripped. We'll watch it. There's another angle, so we'll watch it again in another angle. There you go. He's attacking. There you go. So obviously, you got to be careful of headbutts, right? But besides headbutts, Lethway in general, it's just a different range. Ooh, he got him. He got him. As I was talking about the ranges, he got him. We'll have to look at it from another angle. I believe it was a liver kick, but we'll have to look at it from another angle. So good job. Again, viewer is Kyokushin, right? And what he told me was he initially had a lot more long range techniques planned, but eventually he realized upon watching some of the matches that he had to do more short range strikes, which of course you have in Kyokushin, but much more associated with Lethway. And you got to adjust to Lethway rules. So it's so funny how sometimes, not always, that, that kick definitely connected a little bit. Sometimes the fight style starts resembling the style of the promotion, right? He almost looks like a Lethway fighter. Oh, nice. Oh, did you see that? Oh, he got him with an elbow. He got him with an elbow, guys. Woo. Wow. Wow, he got him. Yeah, that was ruled. Guess that was a KO. Wow. Um, now, in very hardcore left way, right, they would give him a chance to revive. So I'm glad they don't have that in this because, you know, you should definitely go to the hospital after that elbow. You should definitely not try to revive. Congrats to the viewer. Min is his name. I don't know if this is his first Kyokushin match, but here we go. The other angle. Again, he's the one in the black pants. So notice the the hooks are a little bit slow but it's okay so some clinch fighting right now i just want to see the part when he got swept i think he, he did um he did trip and then let's look at the kick let's look at where the kick went oh that was a great combo we missed that in the first one oh that was a great little um left that we saw so nice okay it was a punch it was a punch. It was that same combo he did earlier. He It was the second time upon the exit he threw a left punch. Another thing that Min told me is that a lot of these Lethway fighters in this tournament gave it their all within the first minute. So he also knew that if he could survive the first minute, he's got a chance to use his Kyokushin resilience. Nice one, two. And then again, this little using the crook of your elbow in, in clinch, you see that in Muay Thai and in Lethway, right? It's another way to control the distance. So it's like belly to belly distance, as they say in Lethway. So, oh, you see that kick definitely landed. And then he got him with a little bit of an elbow. I think at this point he realized he could get him with another elbow. So you see him? He got him again. And it's something I would definitely want to show again. Let's show a replay of that. So let's look at this again. So one thing to notice Besides the different clinch ranges, it's not just one clinch range. Look how he uses his forearm. He's going to use his forearm to frame. You see, he's, look at that. One thing I wanted to show too is, so after Min gets announced the winner, he actually does a wide crew. Again, I'm sorry for Lethway fans. I am sure it's not called a wide crew. Wide crew is probably what you would call in Thailand, but he does sort of his own version of it. Um, I guess a Lethway version or like a Kyokushin version. But again, um, Min, let me know if this is a Y crew or is this something else. But yeah, that was pretty cool. So look at that. Just bowing to the ref. A lot of ceremony, right? This is stuff that I'm glad we got this angle of. Hey guys, if you like what you're watching, please press a like, not just for this channel, but also for viewer Min. Now, shout out another viewer Min, because he sent me the video that's going to be my next commentary. And I also just wanted to let everyone know, as you guys can tell, you know, I sprained my ankle. Anyone that's dealing with any sort of physical health issues, man, we'll get through it, right? We'll get through it. That's part of the martial artist journey. It's easier said than done, but we just 
Use it as an opportunity to practice that martial arts spirit. Anyone feel free to message me privately if you're dealing with anything. Just, I got you, man. I got you. I'm dealing with stuff myself. And one day I'm going to get back into training when all this is over. As a positive, my wrist is much better. My wrist is much better. It's been a weird few years, right? And we just keep hanging strong, everyone. We keep hanging strong. Anyways, thank you guys so much. If you haven't pressed subscribe, make sure you subscribe. If you haven't left a comment, leave a comment. What other cool styles or potential style versus style do you want to see? Alright guys, talk to you soon. Make sure to press a like if you haven't pressed a like.